What's up? This is HD News Tech. So I ordered my first pizza from Pizza Hut without cheese because I can't have. Um, by the way, I got money in my hands the last bit until I get paid on Thursday. So because I got like that post nasal drippage, and um, I've been having to give up a lot of those dairy products because the drainage and the sinuses and allergies. So this is gonna be an update. I made a video yesterday, but I never uploaded it. But it explains that um, when I called my parents, when my mom, um, they wouldn't answer the cell number. I had to call their house servers. I still remember it still. And it's in my phone forever. So, so you know, they answered. And, you know, I was like, yeah, you're, we made our decision finally, you know, let me know. And I'm moving down south, apparently. Uh, as I remember a couple of days ago from 48 hours ago or more that I went south and I think later that evening I think I called when I got back home and um they're gonna try to get me down there I guess if I remember correctly if I heard it correctly without my ears playing tricks on me it'll be next week basically and then you know so I'm out in Naples this morning and like uh yeah my ears will do things incorrectly so I may not hear the exact thing but this would be better for me, for one, because I'm having a hard time enough trying to move around without arthritis pain. I got it throbbing every now and then. And I'm afraid it's permanent. For it to be a better place to live, technically, and uh, if I ever get the chance to go there, <laughs> I'm not sure if fully guaranteed yet, of course. I want to see it happen, of course. But, uh, as the lady said, I, I said in the last video or two, um, she did predict it of knowing from heaven that, uh, you know, everything is true in heaven when they say about things like, you know, uh, things happen in heaven truly and they don't lie because it's unholy. And, um, that's one of the things coming up. Um, apparently I'll be down there before the Lord comes, technically. And it seems like um, I've been hearing it. My ears don't play them. As long as my ears don't play tricks on me like I've been hearing, it's going to be by early May, like the first week or so, depending if it stretches any bit. I know I heard about the computer because I, I'm not, I kind of idea tells me that it's going to be a flight going down there and then just buying a machine down there to do all my homework and all my things I need to do, you know, for work. So yeah, the computer needs to be replaced, but until then, I heard something. Oh, it's nothing. All right. So yeah, it's a possibility. Hopefully it comes true and it actually does occur because uh, Illinois is uh, falling apart. The governor just got uh, denied by a judge for extending the stay home order for this COVID-19 uh, outbreak past June. So it's like it's stopped at the moment. But air flights are still working in the U.S. As I know, I looked at them and... At least one hundred fifty or one hundred forty-eight dollars, depending to get down there from uh, from here, probably St. Louis to uh, Fort Myers, for a couple hours. You know, anyways, it's not too bad. I mean, I never flew by myself, but uh, this is probably an opportunity for me because uh, uh, sadly, the state is probably not in the best shape, and with this crisis going on and job losses and. Who knows what could happen with my parents' jobs. And, uh, you know, it's just one of those states that is already in enough trouble, basically, as it is. And it just, they moved here. Her family moved here long ago from Italy. And, yeah, it's just a long history. And I usually get dark quite a bit. In the sun, I don't get as dark as I go get dark in the sun with the sunscreen, of course. But uh, 
the skin kind of lightens, but it gets really dark inside more than it would usually in the past, but it eventually fades. I don't know why I see it like that with my glasses, I guess, because I had them on, so it was kind of darkened because I was in the light mowing grass. So I was like, yeah, my skin's getting a little bit, maybe a little darker, trying to get tan on before <laughs> if this is even a chance. I don't want to burn down there and then have trouble, but still I have to wear probably... Right now I'm wearing like 50 up here and it's like down there it'd be like, I don't know. I mean, I'm kind of fair complected, but not fully. I'm hard to tie in skin, but not all way. It's like only like maybe a quarter of it left. <laughs> Cause I used to be pretty dark. Trust me. I used to get dark within a week or so or more. And uh, it got slower over time. Sometimes some years it took maybe a month the complexion but then you know once it came from straight paleness to dark um it stayed for most of the summer until fall came and then i started fading well not technically at once not all at once because we got all skin it'll stay there for a while it just might get a little light but it'll get dark again in the spring easily and my skin my, my hands will tan and underneath my fan lights because they're like um fluorescent so they're really bright and the good efficient bulbs as well so i tan it really good in walmart stores and where i work with the fluorescent bulbs so it's like i get pretty dark apparently i don't know why i have a, i'm not sure i have a skin allergy to um the sun i know my aunt has one and she is part of my mom's family and that's the tie-ins and she's white as a ghost, I tell you. And I'm not too far off from my face. I'm just maybe a little bit dark, but not really. Not as much as I used to be, technically. But, you know, I started off with freckles and fr fair skin, and I just got darker over my ears with the hair. I started with brown hair as well, so it's like dad's complexion uh, looks, and then it went to my mom's straight directly. And I, I say I'm probably, I got more of that tiny looks than my sister does, for sure. As a 40-year-old and me doing, being like 29 since March, early, first day. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm always, always the one that gets dark in the family, I'm afraid. And uh, I don't take racism that much. It definitely not in the past. It was, oh my God. Being that dark in the family, like, okay, just, whatever. So, if you need to check out and subscribe and comment, like, below. Thanks for watching. See ya.